The rupee has been falling sharply since the start of May and declined more than 5.5% since then. On Monday, Indian currency plunged to an all-time low of 57.54 against the US dollar in early trade. The rupee has shed more value in the last one month against other currencies such as the yen, euro and pound than against the US dollar. The Indian currency, which closed at one-year low of 57.07 against the dollar on Friday, is going through one of its toughest times as it is being perfected by high current account deficit, foreign fund outflows, stronger dollar globally and domestic economic slowdown. Finance Ministry, however, says there is no point to panic and government and RBI is watching the situation closely. I don't think the government needs to take any measures. We are watching the situation closely. But there is, uh, if you see, weakening of all currencies vis-a-vis -vis dollar. So rupee is also not unaffected in that sense. Uh, but I think this is a uh, uh, panic in the uh, market which is unwarranted because this uh, started off with uh, the misinterpretation of what the Federal Reserve Chairman had spoken of in terms of the quantitative easing. They have now more than clarified that uh, this is not imminent, neither it's going to be uh, something which will happen quickly. So I think this uh, this will settle down in a while. And I don't think we should unduly get worried, but we are watching the situation. I think any measures that uh, the government can take are typically of the kind uh, that, that we have announced. We will continue announcing in terms of uh, um, you know, generating stable inflows to finance the current account deficit, as well as reducing the size of the current account deficit. Uh, but those are the measures the government can take. Uh, other measures are uh, obviously in the realm of the Reserve Bank of India. A weakening rupee is a matter of concern for the Indian economy. Weak currency would drive the investors away as they make their earnings in rupee. It also means the importing of inflation as falling rupee means that economy will have to spend around 57.50 for one dollar and imports will become expensive. Crude is the biggest component of India's import bill. Over 70% of country's oil and gas requirements are imported. The rupee weakness means there is little likelihood of a respite from high fuel prices and consequently leading to rise in inflation. With Bureau inputs, Ajay Mishra's report, DD News, New Delhi.